Welcome to History Bedtime Stories in our pajamas in bed. And it's night number 15 of our ongoing series on presidential pets. Night 15, President 15, we are talking about James Buchanan. Buchanan serves as president from 1857 until 1861. He is a Democrat and he's known as the bachelor president because he never marries. His niece, a woman named Harriet Lane, actually steps in to fill the traditional role of first lady as White House hostess and hostess to the nation. As president, he has a pair of bald eagles as a pet. Is that not the most fitting presidential pet you've ever heard of? He actually keeps the bald eagles for a couple of months before they go to a zoo where they're on display as the president of the United States bald eagles. Talk about selling some admittance tickets. He has a little toy terrier that's named Punch. But when you're talking about President Buchanan, the real pet to talk about is Laura. Laura is his Newfoundland dog. And I happen to have grown up with a Newfoundland when I was a little girl. And let me tell you, they look like giant bears. And Laura was no exception. She weighed 176 pounds. She was absolutely massive. She had this big, long, glorious, fluffy tail. And she had a little bit of an oddity that matched her master. She developed the habit of sleeping with one eye completely open. So for hours, she would faithfully sit at the foot of the president and be dead asleep, but with that one eye open, it was really unsettling to visitors. What made it all the funnier is that President James Buchanan was nearsighted in one eye and farsighted in the other. So when he was talking to people, he would often close an eye and tilt his head, looking a lot like the dog that was sleeping at his feet. I hope you're enjoying presidential pet stories and bedtime history stories. Wash your hands, be kind to each other, and we'll see you tomorrow night for president number 16.